The temptation to get a second one of these is very, very high. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign. A sign. Here's some more type stuff. So, pop culture. Pop culture, uh, another one of those that people seem to either love or hate. I love them, never had a problem with them. Um, they pack in double walled thick boxes, they come all the way from Australia. Um, people have melted inserts because sometimes they get left on a runway or in a, I don't know, a shipping container and it's really hot and they melt the inserts. I never had that, never had a problem, like I say. Um, haven't had customs since we left the EU. Uh, or since they changed of that, I can't remember. But I've not had customs. They've declared the proper amount on it, $120 Australian dollars. Um, I'll show you the packaging. So, what's worth a mention is what I've also done is I paid shipping, which is about $17, because it's I got quite a lot. I got this, I mean, this is RAM, this is packed to perfection, and then, I put on a pre-order on top of that that I won't have to pay the shipping for because it's already paid for. I'm not sure if they calculated that at checkout that I was having something that was a pre-order so there'll be extra shipping or not. But there's a there's an idea for you to test. Um, with, they've done this before, I can feel it in there. With um, Compops, you get a free badge and if they can't fit it in the box, to stop them in the box, they put it underneath the invoice. So, pop culture pin, because we have some compops. Um, we also have some non-compops. So to give you some idea just how well they pack it, I mean, double wool box, completely pushed in but not rammed in so yeah let's you know let's have a look through see if i eat my words and some of them are damaged because they've been pushed in so as people may know i collect harley quinns <laughs> so first one out has got a uh, i don't know if you can see that the back is pushed in probably from being shoved in the box and you know, that is hardly the end of the world. I mean, you could put your hand in there and push it up. I ain't gonna bother me too much. In terms of tears, cuts, rips, the box is fine. That would probably push out, weigh it out. It's not the end of the world. Let's get her out anyway. Harley Quinn. It's the one in the dress. See, I kind of, I was collecting Harley Quinns and Harley Quinns and Harley Quinns and then I kind of stepped back for a bit because I think everyone was broke from COVID and whatnot. And then I missed a few drops and then I like drops like the Suicide Squad drops. And yeah, I just kind of never picked it up where I left off. So I thought, you know, I'll pick a few up I haven't got yet. This is one of them. So there we go. Focus on, don't focus on Rita. I shouldn't have worn this t-shirt, should I? Focus on my hat. Bloody cameras. So, Harley Quinn, Suicide Squad. One I haven't got. The special edition one. More expensive everywhere you go. These stands get worse and worse for staying on feet, don't they? Probably don't hold them upside down, but still. I just want to test that theory. So you'll also know, I started a bit of a Britney collection for absolutely no reason, because I don't have Baby One More Time. I've never been a fan, musically. I was always a Christina guy, to be honest. Not that particularly listened to 90s pop, well, that's a lie. When I go clubbing, I do. But, you know. So, 
Cheese is the best for clubs, right? We probably disagree. But anyway, so Brittany has to get Brittany. Oh, you stop focusing on Rita. I need to do Rita oil pop. Clearly, that's what this camera's telling me. He says he's not really into pop music while we're in Rio or t shirt. No, you can't get a staff, can you? So, pop rocks, pop pops. Let's get her out of the pop. Pop, 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 pops. Pivity wop, pop. <laughs> so, Brittany. I don't know why I like Brittany Pops. I have genuinely have no explanation. I just don't get really to them. Maybe it's because they're the one with the snake and I was just kind of thought, well, I've got one. May as well get them all. Speaking of which, I love Pop albums. I have literally right above me, actually. You can't see it. There's a beam that goes across. I've got one, two, three, four, five Pop albums and they look wicked displayed it's just, just a classic just a bit, i don't know something about pop albums that look class and they've just started releasing music moments or music performances like live on stage where they've got full band lineups against like a live backdrop or something they look kind of cool as well and in cases so yeah had to be done um again not a britney fan don't own this album don't really care for it. It will stand out like a sore thumb up there because everything up there is rock. But had to be done and it's done. Should we stick her there? Um let's go back to Harley. Oh no, got more Brittany, I lied. Oh I think this one had a chance of a chase. I've not got the chase. Completely forgot about that. I think on the chase she's wearing a cowboy hat. So yeah, didn't get a chase, that's life, I'm not going to cry, but again, cool pop, let's get her out. <laughs> and you can do it, there we go, there she is, so. Yes, another Britney pop because why not? Harley, another Harley. I took a shine to this one because I thought it was funky. Uh, she's holding a, uh, I'm assuming it's supposed to be a roller derby belt, is it? She's wearing roller boots. Maybe it's not, maybe it's wrestling. I don't know. I do not understand the reference. It just says with belt, possibly from a comic book, possibly from a series, possibly from something. So yeah. She looks a little like this. She has no other pops in the series. Just DC Heroes. Don't know if that references a class of comic book or just the fact she is a DC hero, but she's more of an anti hero, let's be honest. But let's get her out. Again, box, decent condition. It was just that first Harley one where the box was a bit meh. The rest are fine. Could have been like that before it went in the box to be quite honest. And like I said, it's not the end of the world. I can push it out and already mostly have. So Harley, out of the box. There she is. Oh, don't go to the old beard. So yeah, stand. We were talking about how loose the other ones are. This one is too big for the foot. Oh, if you really force it in. There we go. So, we can make it work. There's the belt. The belt's about there. So, pop number four. Five if we include the Britney album, pop six, 
Come on, pop culture. This had to be done. You know. I am a photographer. This will probably go in the studio. Just on the side and looking oh, wicked. Oh, wicked. Yeah, there was no way I wasn't getting this. This is the main reason. This and the turtles, which I didn't get, because I ummed and hard about it for do I really want to spend 40 quid on some turtle Power Ranger crossovers? And by the time I went to order and one of them had sold out and Funko Europe, so I thought, fuck it, can't be asked. And I thought, whatever. So I went to pop culture. And this is why I ordered all this stuff, because I'm on pop culture and said, I ain't done a pop culture order in ages. I'm going to get a bunch of stuff like the Harleys that I haven't already got. And they were selling stuff that wasn't even on Funko Europe yet, which has since been put on Funko Europe, like some of the Britneys and stuff. And even this one at the time, because I don't think this was in the first wave, it was in the second wave. Maybe. And yeah, so I thought, I'll go to pop culture, yeah, get a free badge, test my luck with customs, and yeah, here we go. Mr. Polaroid Man. An ad icon, apparently. I should really put an ad icon collection in the pop room. But it's a body gonna shoot you. The temptation to get a second one of these is very, very high, Mr. Polaroid. In fact, let's let's do the whole. We'll fly for it because I wonder if any of these have actually got comps. Because comp is a completed sale, by the way, is it second-hand sale? Because they're quite new. Polaroid. Not for sale anywhere currently. They must have sold out. £28. I certainly didn't pay that for him. Britney. Album. Oops, I did it again. £37. I certainly didn't pay that for that. Um. Is there a definition of this one? The circus, Britney, but I'm not sure what to search. So I'll just go Britney. It is circus, I thought that's how they quantified it. Not that it says it on a box. £14, Britney, with milkshake, which is apparently crazy. £33. So I would say, even just in those few, I've easily made back what I paid. I think it was $120. I think it was just shy of £100. I can't remember. I'll cut it in about now, just so you know. Um, yeah, she's not listed as been available anywhere. I mean, someone's trying to sell on eBay currently and it's got a price of £2.20, but typically they're going for around £28. So, yeah. In fact, on the map, not one has sold under £28 currently. That's probably because it's a new pop and it's all the rage still. Um, let's move on to our Harleys, see what Harley's kicking out at. Harley Quinn, dress, damage dress. I've already got damage dress, so that's normal dress, the special edition one. £17. Harley belt seventeen pound so what was it like thirty odd never thirty odd sixty let's round down the seventeen to fifteen so we'll say another thirty odd for two that's ninety and then another what seventeen odd so I'm thereabouts if anything I made a few quid by going to pop culture poster shopping locally and I got a free pin badge and I just in general like pop culture <laughs> <laughs>